welcome back to the Whiskey Couch here in sunny South Africa with me Gustav Muller as your host. This is Whiskey Tasting and Food Pairing Review number 152 and I am busy with a series on 14 year old single malt whiskies and I've got a couple of them lined up here behind me. I've already reviewed and done food pairing with the Oban 14 year old and today I am reviewing the Mortlock 14 year old single malt from the Mortlock Distillery. The Mortlock Distillery founded in 1823 owned by Diageo and this is a bottling that was done specifically for the private barrel company here in South Africa. It is cask number 1735 single cask 1735 and bottle number 542 out of 600 and this is bottled at 46 percent alcohol by volume and i know that this is a whiskey that no one will ever find again that is very true because it was a <clears throat> pardon me a limited release but still we're going to learn something about the mortlock distillery when reviewing this whiskey and I can't wait to do that and especially the food pairing that I've done with this Mortlock limited release bottling for the private barrel company. This is a picture of the Mortlock distillery, some of the copper pot stills at the Mortlock distillery and if we look at its at where it is situated exactly let's go to our Scotland map this is it the Highland Lowlands Highlands and the well-known Speyside region and there next to Glenfiddich and Balvinny there you will see the Mortlock distillery in the Speyside region in the Highland of Scotland Excellent, Mortlock single malt, something that you do not find that easily. Very rare because most of it goes into Diageo's blends, if I'm not mistaken. But here we go, Sherry Cask Matured. A rare whiskey, a collectible. Look at that dark, tawny color. Clearly because of the ex-sherry cask maturation. Let's find out what this whiskey has got on the nose for us. Rich and sweet. Mm, this is wonderful. Sherry, raisins, dates. Stewed dark fruit. And then in the background there's a bit of vanilla custard. Baking spices, dark honey, chocolate and a bit of um, almost like coffee espresso. What a wonderful nose. And on the palate. Mmm. It was a good idea to pour this jam a little before the video just to let it settle for a bit. It is smooth. Flavors of fruit cake, dark honey, bitter oak spices to bring the balance. Dark chocolate, ginger, sherry, more baking spices. As I, as I sit here I can just taste the flavors coming and going. Mm. Caramelized fruit, caramelized nuts. And then there's also a bit of earthiness and an oakiness to this whiskey. The finish 
it's medium to long with the dark bitter chocolate, a little bit of tobacco and then some Christmas pudding. 46% alcohol by volume. Let's add a half a teaspoon of water and see if this Mortlock 14 year old opens up a bit. This is a wonderful series, 14 year old single malt whiskies. And I can't wait to do the whole series. There you can see the effect of the water. Oh, grape candy and Christmas pudding. Mmm, drizzled with dark chocolate. And now after a few drops of water it is silky smooth. More sweet honey, more bitter chocolate. The balance is wonderful. The baking spices. So what will my summary be for this Mortlock 14 year old? I think Christmas pudding with bitter chocolate shavings and honey sauce. A complex, rich and surprising whiskey. When you could still find it here in South Africa, it was around 600 Rand, if I remember correctly. And if you want to pair this whiskey with a food snack, because of its richness, its dark flavors, the sweetness, the complexity, um, it lends itself to something like fruit mince. You know that I've set myself this challenge that I'm going to do all of these 14 year olds. I'm going to pair them with French bruschetta with different toppings. So this tram lends itself to a French bruschetta with fruit mince and chocolate shaving topping. Or otherwise minced beef with sweet chutney and just a hint, just a little bit of dark chocolate shavings and this is more or less what it looks like and I'm going to try the beef mince this is it here French bruschetta beef mince fruit chutney to give you that sweet connection with the whiskey the richness of this snack very different to the oban that I did in the previous video oban much lighter much more easy drinking so I had a very light snack to go with with that whiskey this one a bit more complex and a bit more of a heavy snack so let's see if this works well mm. This is just amazing. Oh, wonderful. Ay, ay, ay. This is like a four and a half out of five pairing for sure. How delicious is this Mortlock 14 year old single malt with French bruschetta? beef mince, sweet fruit chutney and a little bit of chocolate shavings. Fantastic. Thank you for watching. Thank you for uh, subscribing and if you find this useful please like the video at the bottom of the video. Invite your friends and I look forward to seeing you at the next video when I'm going to do the third in this series of 14 year old single malt whiskies. Until then, slanjem.